welcome to the viewers now we discuss integral t0 to t1 l of that's lagrangian of q q dot t dt and integral t0 to t1 l of q q dot t plus df dt uh, dt lead to the same equation of motion for the solution we have and here the action of the path that is a uh, s dash if we consider x dash integral t0 to t1 l of q q dot t plus df dt dt and if we break it t0 to t1 l of q q dot t dt plus and if we take it like uh, integral t0 to t1 df that will be integral t0 to t1 l of q q dot t dt plus f of t t0 to t1 and now t0 to t1 l of q q dot t dt plus integral for f t so f t1 minus f t0 if we take it within a bracket therefore s dash is equal to t0 to t s dash equals to uh, t0 to t that's action of path l of q q dot t dt plus f t1 minus f t0 now taking del from both sides there is a virtual action of path del s dash equals to del of t0 to t1 lagrangian of q q dot t dt plus del of f t1 minus f t0 and here it's clear that will be del s plus del of f t1 minus f t0 taking it equation number one it is clear that the second term in one of our HS ought to vanish. Hence, by the principle of stationary action del s dash that will be del s equals to 0 and that leads to the similar set of equations of motions That is, it's clear that we make a similar set of equations since both are zeros. So, here we find the similar set of equation of motions. Now, uh, we end our discussion today.
if you like this video like it share it and don't forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching